practicality of driving a samba today. While driving a samba bus today may require some adjustments, it offers a unique and rewarding experience. The lack of power steering and modern amenities like air conditioning may pose challenges, but the simplicity of the mechanics allow for smoother maneuverability, providing a level of control and responsiveness not commonly found in a 63-year-old classic. This characteristic, along with the nostalgic driving feel, adds to the charm of piloting a Samba bus and contributes to the overall enjoyable driving experience that enthusiasts appreciate even on the road today. Fun Back in the 60s and still now, owning and driving a Samba bus is all about fun and adventure. Whether it's embarking on road trips, camping in scenic locations, or attending vintage car rallies, the Samba evokes a sense of joy and nostalgia. Its sociable interior layout encourages conversation and camaraderie among passengers, fostering memorable moments and lifelong friendships. And speaking of fun, check out this special key to unlock the gas cap and the engine compartment. Cultural Icon The Samba bus has become more than just a vehicle, it is a cultural icon. Its association with the 1960s counterculture and the hippie movement has solidified its place in popular culture. With its vibrant paint jobs, peace signs, and flower decals, the Samba embodies the spirit of freedom, adventure, and self-expression. Passenger Capacity The Samba bus stands out not only for its exceptional passenger capacity but also for its compact size. In today's automotive landscape, Finding a vehicle that can comfortably seat nine passengers is a rarity, typically limited to full-size passenger vans. However, the Samba defies expectations by offering such a spacious interior within its relatively small frame. Its wheelbase, compared to modern vans, may seem modest, yet the clever layout and efficient use of space allow room for three rows of seating to accommodate nine adults.